Hello Tamers and welcome to round 3 of the Union Impact Wars. We have Mastermon on the left, a fusion yellow purple deck, and Sleepmon on the right. Mastermon's going first. Security setup! Digimon standby, let's open the digital gate. Active draw, raising, a Digitama is hatched for Demi Maramon. Moving into main, it evolves into Tapirmon for zero cost. One draw, and then at two cost, Demi Devimon is played from the hand onto the field. 1 2, turn over. Active and draw, raising, Digitama is hatched for Upamon. First, it evolves into Lopmon at zero cost, one draw. Then, for one cost, it evolves into Turuyemon. One, one draw. Finally, to end things off, TK is played directly from the hand at four cost. 1 2, 3, 4. Well, you guys know the drill. Clavis Angelmon is added to the hand. With that turnover, active and draw, in the raising phase, Tapirmon moves out onto the field. First, Tapirmon goes for the security attack with 2000 DP, security check. And it is Unimon with 6000 DP, so Tapirmon is destroyed. Sorry, I just realized I mixed up the position of the deck just now and the trash, so let me just quickly fix that. When Tapirmon is destroyed, draw one card. And with Demi Merrimon's Inheritable, when destroyed, draw one and discard one card from the hand. So one draw, and Mastermon is discarded. With that, Tapirmon is trashed. Now Demi Devimon will go ahead and attack security as well with 3000 DP. Security check. And it is Salamon with only 2000 DP, so Demi Devimon survives. Hold up, I just realized I got the deck positions mixed up for Mastermon as well, so let me fix that. Now for two cost, another copy of Demi Devimon is played onto the field. One, two. And for 4 cost, the tamer, Ishida Yamato. 1, 2, 3, 4, memory moves to 3. When played, you may recycle a purple card from the trash. And in this case, Tapirmon is returned to the hand. Turnover, active and draw. In the raising phase, Turuyemon moves out onto the field. First, Turuyemon will attack Demi Devimon. Upamon's inheritable. When attacking, once per turn, if your security is 3 or less, draw 1 card. And with 6000 DP, Demi Devimon with 3000 is destroyed. Now Turuyemon will digivolve into Injewumon for 3 cost. 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. Now this is the Injewumon from the starter deck when digivolved into, if your security is 3 or less, recovery plus 1. And finally the Tamer card, Kari is played for 3 cost. 1, 2, 3, turn over, active and draw. In the raising phase, Digitama is hatched for Demi Maramon. In main, it evolves into Tapirmon for zero cost, one draw. Then the Demi Devimon on the field evolves into the blocker Vilemon for two cost, one draw. And next, the yellow rookie Tinkermon is played from the hand at three cost. One, two, three, turn over, memory moves up to three, active, and draw. In the raising phase, Digitama is hatched for Upamon again. At zero cost, it evolves into Salamon, one draw, and then at two cost into Ankylomon. 1-2, one, 1 draw. Now the Njewumon on the field will evolve into Mega, transforming into Clavis Angelmon. 1-2-3, one, 1 draw. Turnover, memory moves up to 3, active and draw. In the raising phase, Tapirmon moves out onto the field. First, Tinkermon attacks with 3000 DP, security check. And it is Unimon with 6000 DP, so Tinkermon is destroyed and sent to the trash. But that is exactly what Mastermon wants. Next, Tapirmon will attack security as well with 2000 DP. Security check. Oh, but it's the Tamer card TK, which is played without paying the cost and, as usual, the search. So these are the two remaining cards in Slatemon security, and of course, they are choosing to add the blocker, Unimon, to the hand. Now, at three cost, Vilemon will evolve into ultimate, Lady Devimon. 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. When did you evolve into, draw 2 cards and trash 2 cards in your hand. 1, 2. With that, Mastimon chooses to discard Petermon and a copy of Ishida Yamato to the trash. And with that, the Tinkermon Petermon combo has been set up. And now, ending things off with a final evolution, Lady Devimon will evolve into Mastimon for 4 cost. 1, 2, 3, 4. One draw. When Digivolved into, first, discard one security of both players from the top. So now both players will lose one security, Mastermon loses Tapirmon, while Slatemon loses 
and Kilomo. Then, you may play one level 4 or less yellow or purple Digimon from your trash without paying the cost. Of course, the target is Petermon. Petermon's effect when played. Play a Tinkermon from your hand on trash without paying the cost. And of course, there is a Tinkermon in the trash. This is it. The ultimate low-cost resurrection rush combo. With one security left on Slatemon's field and four attackers assembled on Mastemon's, turn over. At the start of Slatemon's turn, at the very least, Kari gives a plus one memory since security is only at one, active and draw. In the raising phase, Ankylomon emerges onto the battle area. First, Ankylomon with its 4000 DP attacks the tapped Tapirmon with only 2000. When attacking with Upamon's inheritable, draw one. Tapirmon is destroyed, but as usual, when destroyed, draw one card. And with Demi Merimon, draw one and discard one. The discard is chosen to be Petermon. With that, Tapirmon is destroyed. And now, Clavis Angelmon will attack Mastemon security. Again with Upamon's inheritable, draw one. And when attacking, if your security is three or less, Clavis Angelmon unleashes its effect. One of your opponent's Digimon gets minus 6k DP until the end of the turn. So in order to reduce the number of attackers, Petermon is inflicted with minus 6,000, reduced to zero, and destroyed. Security check. And it's NJ Woman with 7,000. Clavis Angelmon survives. Now, at four cost, Slatemon plays Padamon. Memory's at five, so it moves down to one. This is the Probo Pack Padamon. When played, if your security is one or less, recovery plus one, so regaining some lifeline. Next, the Ankylomon on the field will evolve into another copy of Angewumon for three costs. One, two, three, one draw. And again, when Digivolved into, since security is at two, recovery plus one from the deck, Slatemon's life now matches Mastemon's. Although Slatemon himself has yet to make an appearance, this is the focus of the Slatemon deck. Security control, coming back from even the toughest of situations. Turnover, memory moves up to three, active and draw. In the raising phase, Digitama is hatched, for Demi Maramon. First, with her 12,000 DP, Mastemon attacks the eyesore on the field that is Clavis Angemon. Since he only has 10,000, he is eliminated. Now, Tinkermon will evolve into a Petermon from the hand at two cost, one two, one draw. And then Petermon will evolve into Angewumon for three cost, one two, three, one draw. This is the same version of Injewumon that Slatemon is running. When they evolved into, if your security is three or less, recovery plus one from the top of the deck. So Mastemon's recovering some life here as well. With that turnover, memory moves up to three, and with Kari, memory plus one. Active and draw. In the raising phase, Digitama is hatched for another copy of Yellow Upamon. Moving into main, it evolves into Salamon for zero cost, one draw. Now. At 3 cost, Angewumon will evolve into another copy of Clavis Angemon. 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. Clavis Angemon attacks Mastemon. First, with Upamon's effect, 1 draw. And with Clavis Angemon's own effect, one of the opponent's Digimon gets minus 6k DP until the end of the turn. The target is, of course, Mastemon. Reduced to 6000 DP, she's no longer a match for Clavis Angemon's 10,000. Mastemon is destroyed. With that, Hatsamon evolves into Turuyemon for one cost, one, one draw, still Slaymon's turn, and the end things off with another copy of Kari at three cost. One, two, three, turn over, active and draw, nothing can be done in raising, moving into main. Now, Mastemon is in a bit of a difficult situation. They're not drawing into any purple rookies to evolve Demi Merimon into. And right now, although they've got Petermons in the trash, they don't have extra Tinkermon. Because the Tinkermon that was previously milled is currently in Angewumon's evolution sources. So using a slightly different strategy, Piedmon, the Dark Master, is played directly from the hand at 12 cards. Memory's at 3, so it moves to 9. When played, you may play up to 2 level 4 or less purple Digimon from the trash at no cost. However, your when played effects do not trigger. With this, two copies of the rookie, Tapirmon, spawn on the field assembling four attackers. Turnover at the start of Slaymon's turn with Kari, memory plus one, reaching the max of 10, active, and draw. In the raising phase, Salamon moves out. First, a third copy of Kari is played at three cost. One, two, three. Clavis Angelmon attacks Mastemon secured. First, with Upamon, one draw. 
And then with Clavis Angelmon's effect, minus 6k DP gets inflicted on one of the Tapirmons. With 2k, it is destroyed, but Mastermon gets to draw one card. Security check. And it is Wizardmon with 4000 DP destroyed. Now Salamon evolves into the blocker Unimon at 2 cost. 1-2, one, 1 draw. Turuyemon evolves into Injeumon at 3 cost. 1-2-3, one, 1 draw. Now this is the brand new version of Injeumon from Booster 3. When Digivolved into, one of your opponent's Digimon gets security attack minus 2 until the end of your opponent's next turn. And the target chosen is Tapirmon. But honestly, that doesn't matter too much. Because now, at 3 cost, Injeumon will evolve into the Royal Knight Slapemon. 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. When Slapemon is Digivolved into, up to 5 of your opponent's Digimon get security attack minus 2 until the end of your opponent's next turn. So during Mastermon's next turn, none of your Digimon can inflict damage. Turn over, memory moves up to 3, active and draw. In the raising phase, still stun. At 2 cost, Tapirmon evolves into the blocker, Filemon. 1, 2, 1 draw. Then, with 10,000 DP, Piedmon attacks Clavis Angelmon with also 10,000. Slatemon chooses not to block with Unimon, and both are destroyed. And with that, Injeumon will now evolve into another copy of Bastemon. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1 draw. It's time. Once again, when Digivolved into, discard one security from both players. It's oh, it's Drum Sword for Mastemon. That's gonna hurt. And for Slaymon, it's gonna be Slaymon. Again, a level 4 or less yellow or purple Digimon from the trash can be played without paying the cost. You guys know the drill. Here comes Petermon. And with Petermon's own effect, a Tinkermon is played for free from the hand. Turn over. At the start of Slaymon's turn though, there are now 3 Hickories. And since security is less than 3, that's plus 1, plus 2, plus 3 for 6 memory to start with. Active and draw. In the raising phase, Digitama is hatched, the last Upamon. At zero cost, it evolves into Lopmon. One draw. First, Slatemon attacks Mastemon's security. The new NJ Umon's inheritable. When attacking, if your security is three or less, you can play one level three or less yellow Digimon from your hand without paying the cost. And with that, Paramon is deployed for free. Security check. Lady Devimon with 8,000, Slatemon survives. Now Unimon evolves into NJ Umon as well. For 3 cost, 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. And then for another 3 cost, Injeumon will evolve to the next stage for another copy of Slaymon. 1, 2, 3, 1 draw. Slaymon's effects when Digivolved into again. All of Bastemon's Digimon get security attack minus 2 until the end of your next turn. They can't inflict any damage. Now the new Slaymon attacks Bastemon's security. First, with Upamon's Inheritable, another draw. And with the new Injeumon's Inheritable again, when attacking, a level 3 yellow Digimon can be played for free. Here comes another copy of Patamon. Final security check for Mastemon. And it is... Tapirmon with only 2000 DP, destroyed. And to end things off, one of the Patamons evolves into Unimon for 2 cost. 1-2, one, 1 draw. Oh my god, this defense is insane. Turnover. Memory moves up to 3, active and draw. But seriously, what can Mastemon even do in this situation? It's true that with 12,000 DP, Mastemon can easily defeat any of the Slatemons, but when Slatemon is destroyed, one of the opponent's Digimon gets minus 11k, so they can kill any of the other attackers or even the blocker Vilemon. Well, you're just gonna go ahead and do it. Mastemon attacks the upper Slatemon. Of course, it's destroyed, and when destroyed, Minus 11k DP to an opponent's Digimon, Vilemon is obliterated. At this moment, Mastemon chooses to play another copy of Piedmon. At 12 cost, memories at 3, it moves to 9. And with its effect, at the very least, two Vilemon blockers can be deployed onto the field for free. Turn over. At the start of the turn, memory moves up to 10 with the Hickories. Active. Draw. Raising. Lotmon moves out onto the field. Patsamon attacks, of course Vilemon blocks, and with 6,000 DP, Patsamon is destroyed. Now Lotmon attacks, with Upamon's inheritable, one draw, but of course, the second Vilemon blocks and Lotmon is destroyed. And finally, with 11,000 DP, Slatemon fires its arrow of justice. 
within Jeyumon's Inheritable. First, it gets another free summon of Padamon. But with that, Mastermon has no remaining security and no active blockers on the field. It's a direct attack and the match is over. The winner is Slatemon.